a very exciting week ahead, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is, it is, and it was an exciting week and last been, week and, as well. And we really will know where we are after this week. Wow. Let's get on with the show, yeah? Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Let's get on with the show. If we win, and, and, and there's a few things I've got to do which I'm not too happy about, but it, unfortunately, it, it, I hope no Manchester United fans are watching it. Involves some apologies, so I okay. can't believe it. But yeah, let's, let's go. get on the show. Do you know what? It gets on my nerves. I, I was listening to um, the, other, talk, the other day. Please do not no, listen no. to that station. Oh, no, no, nothing to do with oh, that station. Okay. Right. It's uh, another one on the, uh, the um, Richard and Judy. You know, Richard and Judy. CFC Fan TV, I was listening to them talking bullshit. <laughs> Richard and Judy? I call them Richard and Judy, yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah. when are they on there? <laughs> right. Going back in the, going right. back in the past I was, I was this morning. That, I was watching that the other day and um, mm. they're going on about Chelsea and Tottenham is the London game, you know, the biggest yeah, London yeah, game. Yeah. Yeah. What bullshit, right? These teams together have not won this... If you put their titles together, right, have not mm. won exactly the same amount of titles as Arsenal. They've been both relegated. Yes. Both relegated. Yes. And they're trying to say they're the <laughs> biggest game in London. Uh, what a cheek. What a fucking cheek, eh? Mm. I'm sorry, mate. I can't. I'm going to swear, don't swear. I know, but I can't have it. I can't have it. Mm. Arsenal Spurs will always be the biggest because it's Arsenal, yeah? Mm. Right? We are the biggest club. We still are the biggest club, you know? We're the yeah. third biggest club in. In England, mm, still, yeah, 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 right. When it comes yeah. to everything, when you put everything together, trophy-wise and everything, we mm. are the third biggest club in England. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let them remember that. Yeah. And it's, what am I looking for? I'm looking forward to uh, Sunday. Yes. Hopefully, we don't um, we don't send out too many um, players to um, to Kiev. To, to Kiev. I hope we don't send no. any of them. I just hope we got mm. everyone fit, mm. ready. Mm. Um, I'm slightly concerned with our left back situation. I think it's going to be tough. On, but hopefully, we we probably might have to play with a three like we did against Bournemouth because yeah. because otherwise, I think um, Klasnac might get exposed. But um, it's just going to be a terrific game, and mm. hopefully, they'll have a hard game against uh, <laughs> Inter, Inter, Milan. Inter Milan and. Mm. Um, we will uh, benefit from it, but we shall confident. see. I mean, I'm confident we'll get some sort of result. Whether we can win the game is another thing. How about you? How about you? You're confident that we can get some sort of result, so some you don't think we're going to win? Well, I'm, I'm confident we can get some. I, I'm, I'm not sure whether we can win the why? game. Why? But why though? Mm. I, have to, I, I have to ask why. We're playing, don't get me wrong. Well, at the moment, at this present moment, they're mm. on fire, aren't they? Well, I don't know if they're on fire. And uh, mm. we're not, although we're getting the results, we're not playing brilliant. I don't, know if, I don't know if they're on fire. Well, I mean, you I, go I by the last game. Well, they had a, completely... a fantastic result against Chelsea. But we mustn't forget that we should have beaten Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. No, we didn't. And that's yeah, important. no, but you're saying that. If we had done taking our chances, mm. we would have beaten Chelsea as well. So what does that say about us? And also, we are 17 games unbeaten, which they're mm. not. And also, they come into Emirates, where they hardly ever win. Okay, Tottenham fans, if they're listening, might say, we don't win up at formerly White Lane. They hardly ever win at Emirates, mm. you know. But it's interesting, you're saying about Richard and... I was, I was, I was thinking, <laughs> Richard and Judy, I didn't know they were on no, CFC. Call, you call, I, them I call them Richard. I call them Richard, Richard and Judy. The way they carry on. Okay. Anyway, yeah. Well, the but thing you is, know you know what, what I would say is that you... Even though I don't watch them and I don't want to deter, defer from the point, they are going to say that. But what I would say is that mm. I'd even disagree with you. I would say it's not us Tottenham, it's us Chelsea. I would say that's the biggest game now because you're talking about winning. We have won things, Chelsea have won things. Mm. It's us, unfortunately it's Chelsea, then us, then Tottenham. So I would say that is the biggest game, us and Chelsea. But this is a massive game and I'm very, very confident of winning. I mean, I know Tottenham had a great result against Chelsea, but they come into Emirates where they got beaten last season. Mm -hmm. you know what? We lost to White Island, fair enough. But they got beaten and like I said, they hardly ever, ever win. So I agree with you. Hopefully we don't take out too many players and hopefully they get tired of it. But I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Then we've got the Carabao EFL Cup next week. But yeah, I'm, I'm confident. I think we'll win, hopefully, 2-0. What do you reckon? 
You ain't got Cowboys, we've got Man United next week. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got Man United next week. Well, then that's we, what I'm saying. It's yeah, we've got, we've, got, we've got Tottenham again on the 19th. Sorry, yeah, that's right. On um, the 19th yeah. in the Carabao Cup. But yeah, you're talking about Tottenham and Man United, two big games. Yeah, yeah, massive games, but a ridiculous schedule. Mm. To have Tottenham on Sunday and then Man United on the 5th. Two massive, massive, massive games mm. like that in a number of days is ridiculous. Yeah, well, we shall, we shall see. It's ridiculous, a... but I'm, 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 I'm confident that we'll beat them. But that's what I mean. That's why I, I wanted to pick up. Why do you? Why are you saying that you're confident of getting some results? I think we'll get surely some sort be, of results. But shouldn't you be confident of us winning, especially as we're at home as well, and the record we have? I'm not sure whether we're playing well enough to win the game. Yeah, but it doesn't but I mean, if we if we can get the luck we did against Port, but who knows what can happen? Yeah, but, but yeah, go on. Go we've got, on. We've got um, like, I thought a very lucky win against Port. I thought. Yeah. Uh, look, there's a lot of people say. <laughs> I heard Peter. I said I heard the other day, and I respect um, I respect their opi his opinion, Graham. Ooh. But he said our defended our defending was uh, good on the other day. Well, I didn't think so. I thought it was. I, I, I thought. I, I thought. I thought um, if you're gonna, the goalkeeper shouldn't have always worked really hard, and that means to me the defending is not doing very well. You know what I'm saying? In the last mm -hmm. few minutes, and we, we, the goal we give away as well. If you look at it, we had six players yeah. in their area. Yeah. 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 We're one minute from half time, and a lot yes. of people are blaming Mwobi for that goal. Well, he has to go take but, a shot. Yeah, no, it? but it's. There's still 90 yards True. To, to work with. Yes, this why, is true. why have we got all these players up in the box with yeah. a minute to go? There's no yeah. need for it. No, that's true. And when we've lost the ball, and I love Torreira as well, he was mm. up there, he wasn't in his position. Mm. Bellerin was out of position. They're all out of position. Yeah. The next minute, yeah, we've no. lost the goal. When, yeah, no, this, this is true. This is true. But, but, then, yeah, but then what? Yeah, this is true. And, and we can't that. do that against Spurs. No, but then, yeah, but that's, but that's coming on to my next point. Mm. Because let's say they are the full team and they're on fire, which I don't think they're on fire. They might be doing well, obviously. Mm. I'm just form, being honest. Yeah, but form goes out of the window, doesn't it? Because any time when we were the dominant force and we still are in trophy, mm. every time the media or Tottenham or Tottenham fans, I think, would, from what I understand, would say form goes out the window. So why can't yeah, form go out the window when we play true. them? It's true. Yeah. But I'm just yeah. saying at the moment, the way we're, they're playing, I think it's going to yeah, be... Yeah, well, the way they're playing, but the way they're playing means nothing to us, does it? But then <laughs> I... It doesn't mean nothing to us. I am half, I'm one of these people that are not always 100%. But yeah, I, but, no, but... Um, right, I, I, 17 games on being, hopefully it'll be 18. Let's hope you're right. On Sunday. Well, let's hope so. Like I said, I'll, I'll go for 2-0. Alexander, assuming he plays, which hopefully will. 45, half-time 1-0, and, and Pierre. Mighty, full time, two now. That's what I would say. You can well, start at the moment, they've not just caught us. If you're looking at. Uh, no, we're not going to go into this again. No, too much into it again. If you're looking about in league league wise, forget all the other stuff. Yeah. League wise, they've not just caught us, they've gone past us, haven't they? So, at this present moment, but lots of things, but things can change. In football, uh, things can change in a week, never mind yeah, yeah. in a few months. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, at the moment they've gone past us, but I mean they, that can't be that can be um, that can be fixed. I don't know about you. Well, uh, <laughs> by the look on your face, you know what my answer is. No, they haven't caught up to us. How? How have they caught up to us? League-wise, they have. League-wise, league they've gone yeah, past but, us. Yeah, but that's they're playing in the Champions League. We're yeah, playing in the Europa League. We played in the Champions League for twenty-two seasons. Yeah, but he's asking you now if. They, have they caught us? It's no. not what is, what's happened in the past. Well, I'm not going to get into all this again. Yeah, well, he's asking at this present moment, at this present moment, have they well, caught us? They've gone past us, no, league-wise. No, they That's haven't. So you judge a team by no. league. Because, like I said last week, and I have to say it again, if they had won trophies, then I would say yes. But the fact they have not won trophies, then I will say no. Because all we used to hear mm. was, oh, all we do is get in the top four. Oh, all we do is get in the top four. And as soon as we dropped out of the top four, suddenly the top four was important. Hang on, hold on. Have Liverpool won trophies? No, they haven't. Are they, are they in front of us at the moment? Squad wise, yes. Not trophy wise. No, no, I'm talking about. Have they, are they. If you put the same question about Liverpool, yeah. would you say Liverpool are in front of us? Squad wise, not trophy wise. Because Liverpool, that's what I mean. But that's what they're trying to say. They're trying to say what. That's what they're trying. That's the question. 
Yeah, but so what I'm trying to say is, uh, and the same question goes with Spurs. Yeah, but the question has to involve everything. I'm not having this because they've ended up a few seasons ahead of us. They, 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 they've overtaken us. No, because, if, because if that's the case, we've You're not answering the question. You're not answering the question. We're going over this time and time again. Yeah, I'm answering the question. The question was... I'm answering the question. They're not asking about asking, trophies, no, they're asking about no, where the, the situation... No, but when you ask a question like that, it's not black and white. You cover everything, OK? Because if that's the case now, you could say the Man City... Would you say Man City have overtaken uh, Manchester United without trying to bring other teams into it? Would you say that? Of course that? they're overtaking them. The OK, so Man, Man, so Man City now are more successful than Manchester United were? No, but... Exactly. No, well, there trying, you go. They are the better well, team at the moment. No, but if you look at everything up, on, on the whole, well, then if who you is more successful? The question wasn't asked like that, was but it? But that's what I'm saying. When you answer that question, you've mm. got to look at everything. Unless the person who asks the question, you've got to say a time limit of how many seasons. And you've got to say what you put into that. Because that's what I mean. Let's go. Well, I know what you're going to say. And it's very, very hard to whittle it down to one. But it's got to be... When we won the league, and why are It's got to be because that game we should have won about three, four, or five more. And in the end, we ended up getting a draw, which we should have absolutely not settled for. But it's got to be that. Well, it depends what you're looking at. I mean, if you're looking about the end result, I agree. But you're asking me for watching as a, spe asking, a game as a spectacle. You're asking what, as a spectacle, as, as a spectacle, mm -hmm. what I enjoyed most, mm -hmm. because it was just two days before Christmas. Yeah, I know what you're going to say. When we beat them 5-0 at White Hart Lane. Oh, see, I didn't go to that, that's what I mean. No, see? no, no, 1978, <laughs> Christmas time. You mean with, the, with Liam Brady's curler? And it was Liam Brady's curler, 5-0. Yeah. Five nil. Yeah. John Pratt's back pass in the first uh, minute of the game. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've Alan seen Sunderland that, that's scored. incredible. And that was my favourite moment because it was two days before Christmas. <laughs> and we were singing Silent Spurs to the tune oh, of gosh. Silent Night. Well, let's hope we're singing that on Sunday. But, well, it's got to be, the, it's got to be winning like, the league at Wilder. It doesn't get no better than that, does it really? Because we played so well, it's just that Yeah, result-wise, yeah, but, no, um, but we winning played the well. league there. Yeah. Uh, but then you, but to then, me, there was a little bit of tinge of disappointment because we didn't was, win the game there. And we should have, we should have. Yeah. But, but, so, but it was a bit flat for me. But I'm just no, saying, no, it can't no, be flat. It, it was a little bit flat because I'd like to win it. But, when, when you're two 0 up, I'd like to win it in style. Okay, but you're saying it was a little bit flat. Was it flat when, <laughs> when Robbie well, Keane, unfortunately, even so, uh, everyone goes on a bad day well, because we won it there. I, I agree with you. Yeah, yeah. But, had we not done it there, we would have. We had four games to win it anyway, so it wouldn't have played. Yes, no, but the thing is, you're but saying... anyway, so yeah. I agree with you, but as mm. a spectacle and what I enjoyed the game as, mm. a, as a spectacle, I've got mm. to say when we beat them 5 0. But you're saying it was flat, and I can, I agree with that, but the thing is. And my worst was when, my worst. Oh, no, no, experience, we're not talking about, we're, let's not talk about that. <laughs> that doesn't, that doesn't exist. <laughs> was the 5 0 when no, they beat us. But why bring that up? No, but that's the same Don't bring that up, it's, forget yeah. about that. Just going, just going to. Anyway, go on. And the thing is, the flat one, you say it's flat. And yeah, we were flat. Oh, up until the final second. And then, and then, and then Robbie Keane scores. They start going mad. And then the realisation is that we won the league. <laughs> that, that was the funniest thing. Yeah, okay, I, yeah. I think, I think some Tottenham fans had forgotten that we only needed a draw. <laughs> <laughs> but what I'm, what I'm trying to say, that that's, great. As, far as, great. as far as watching the game as a spectacle yeah. and everything, enjoying yeah, it, especially, yeah, two, especially two days before Christmas. Fair enough. I enjoyed Christmas that year. <laughs> but, right. but, but you, but you, but I haven't said that though, you did go to the, did you go when we won the league? In 1971 when race No, won? no, no. I oh, start, you weren't I there? I started going in 72. Okay. Um, right, so you was just one, you was just one year No, out. I missed that that one, I missed that Okay. Okay, so that's okay. So okay, that's it. Winning the league at White Hart Lane tops up. Well, being able to go the two-two, two thousand and four when um, Patrick Vieira scored and Robert Pires scored. Fantastic. 
I'll start with this. Well, the funny thing is, I don't know. I don't well, know where this question. It's more deluded. Spurs I, fans. Or well, are you? I don't think it's. I, 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 don't, oh. I, don't, I don't. I don't. I don't think that's a question. And I'll start with. I'll say the that's Tottenham fans. Cut. Yeah, that's, that's right. It's not a tough one. It's easy for me. That it's the top. It's the Tottenham fans. It's the Tottenham fans. And, and and the thing is, to call me deluded, I would like to ex them to explain to me this person calling me deluded, because I would. I, I I would. I will answer the question. It might like be this. something to do your. When we want saying that we're going to win the tra uh, quadruple. Well, by the way, where's my money? I'm glad you brought up. Where's my money? Oh, man. And I don't want no fake counterfeit notes. Where's my money? All right, I'm going to pay you up. Yeah. You. I yeah. don't want no installments. I'm going to pay you up. <laughs> you must be joking. And my first installment you is twenty pence a week. Must be joking. Let me see. Twenty pence a week. Come on, put another one in there. No, no, no. Twenty pence a week. You could pay week. football like this. You remember that? Yeah, it's you 20 pay pence. Like that. I'll pay you every week you 20 pence. You must be joking. Right. No, thank you. Right. You must be joking. What is this? Only fools and horses? No. no. Sorry, Cannon and Ball. It's the first installment. Cannon and Ball, even though other programs, other programs are available. When the man, the, I think Cannon and Ball owed the man £100 and they was paying him £1 coins. You must be joking. What, what, what can I do with that? I could, I could just buy, buy a Freddo with that. Other chocolates are available. No, but you know, it's an instalment. 20 no, pence thank instalment. You. No, thank you. 20 pounds 20 is an instalment. 20 pence is not an instalment. But like I said, when I'm talking to this, this I will, I will, I will. Even though I don't think I lost a bet, but I'm, I'm being kind to you. And I thought, no, you're being kind. If you're being kind, you would give me 20 pounds. No, thank you. And the thing is, I will answer the question like this. When we, Lost at Stanford Bridge this season, unfortunately. Okay. I came you. out, I came out. I'll tell you the what ground. I'll do. I'll tell you what I'll do, yeah? Go on, go on. I'll lap it by five pence. No, 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 don't forget it, forget it, forget it. Forget it. No? Forget it. No, forget it. I'll oh. pick by five pence. 20 pounds now you're talking. 10 pounds now you're talking. But anything less than that, no. That's the installment. No. That's no. an installment. So no. I'm paying in installments. That's mm. fair enough, isn't it? No, no, thank you. No, thank you. You agreed to installments, didn't I you? I never agreed to nothing. I agreed to my money. But I didn't agree to no 20 pence installment. Uh, like I said, when we lost at Stamford Bridge, I came out and I was confronted by a Chelsea fan. And this is what he said, and I quote, he said, oh, you're so deluded. So I said to him, do the invisibles exist? He said, yes. I said, goodbye. And that's what I had to say. He said, yes. So if I'm deluded, do the invisibles exist? Did we win the league a while later? And also, keep who is this on person? I can say what I like. Who is this person calling me deluded? I'm not. I don't. I don't think I'm deluded. I'm not calling Tottenham fans deluded, but I don't think I'm deluded. So I, 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 I can only say I don't think I'm deluded, and I think the Tottenham fans are not deluded. I don't. I think they know the truth. Some of them, the ones who try to be bad, what it is is that they dislike us so much that that clouds their judgment. I don't think it's delusion, it's they cloud the judgment because there's such resentment, and that's me putting it mild, putting it lightly, because there's so much resentment towards us. It's not delusion, it's just anger. I won't say another word because it's too strong. <coughs> it's, just, it's just anger. What's that's this? What's, what's all this? You're not oh. pain. No, 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 no. That's well, it's funny that you say that. I just noticed. What's yeah. all this? Then? Well, it's because our women, Nigerian women, super focused, well done super focused, we made it through to the final. And we are the holders of the African Nations Cup. It's called something else, but I call it African Nations Cup. We beat, uh, I think it's South Africa, on penalties. No, it's not South Africa. Yeah. I can't remember who we beat. Oh, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. I'll have to, right. I'll have to come back to you on that. I think it's, it might be Ghana or someone. Cameroon, sorry, Cameroon, sorry. We beat Cameroon on penalties, 4-2. And Gossi Ebere scored the winner. So we're going to well, be well, playing that's... Well done, anyway, going off the subject. We're so. going to be playing anyway, South take, Africa. Don't forget. Take. In the capital. You, you're wit in the, uh, your in witness. In the, your witness is here. I've given you 20 pounds. We're not pence. in court. Take in it. In the capital, Accra. On, installment paid. On, on, on Saturday. So. Well, that's, that's my installment. You don't, don't no, want thank you. It. I want 20 pounds. Well, but I'm interested to hear what you say about this. What's this? About this silly question, which I don't even think is a question. Well, I think it's a, I think it's a photo finish. A photo finish? You can talk. You, I think it's a photo you're finish. You're not trying to have a go at me as well, are you? I think you're both deluded. Well, you're ways. deluded, mate. You're the one who's deluded. Call me deluded. You're deluded. Yeah. Yeah, you're deluded. They, I mean, I'm, I'm seeing the, the, the DVD they've, they've put out about <laughs> the Chelsea game already. That's kind of... Yeah, well, they've won, though, to be fair. They no, won. they put they it won. out. They put how, do you, how do you know that, though? How do you know that? That they put it out already? It's got the day Spurs took a step nearer to the. <laughs> to what? 
<laughs> to, the, to the Golden Heights. Are you serious? You know, that's good. <laughs> no, it's something like that anyway. It's something like that. I can't think of what it was. But... <laughs> that's brilliant. That's brilliant. <laughs> to, the, to, the, to the dizzy heights. The only thing is they've got Man City in front of them. They might take a bit of work to get past them, but... Who? Mind you, having said that, you know, mm. Man City, I mean, I don't, I don't think they'll ever get past Man City this season. I mm. think Man City is going to be a bit too strong. Well, you mean to beat, to beat them or get mm. past them? I mean, I heard there was a few of them saying that they're back in the title race, you know. Really? Is that what they think? Yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. Maybe they fit them in the tie race. Yeah. What do you think? Do you think they're in the tie race? Well, hopefully by five o'clock on. Um, yeah, but five. Or was it five o'clock on, on uh, Sunday? Sunday evening. Will be. They'll be more in the top four race rather than the tie race. Wow. Hopefully. hopefully. Anyway. Hopefully. Hopefully. But then that's that. Qu that's that question. As it comes to, I think it's a photo finish. Well, it's a photo finish for you. Photo finish. But to me, it's not even a question. I think. I think it's not even a question. It's not even a question. So, come on, whoever says that, be brave enough to show me who you are and tell me who you support, okay? Be brave enough. And, and, and please, on this show, we like to have intelligent questions, not silly questions. Thank you. Yeah. How's your day been? Well, how's your week been so far? Yeah, up until today. Okay, I mean, uh, course, good, win, good win on Sunday. It was a good win. On, it, it, it was a good win on Sunday. Um, it was a good win on Sunday. We, we, we were, we I mean, good result. I don't think the performance result. was great. Well, the performance was good enough to win once, wasn't it? We could have been very lucky, but Bournemouth were lucky last season. But other than that, it's been all right. I've been mean, watching, okay. the, you know, uh, I watched the, um, not much, not much going on really apart from that. I mean, I'm looking okay. forward to, to this week's football. Okay, so am I. But what, what you was going to, you had something yeah. like up your sleeve. Well, you first of all, to... I've got to make a correction. I said that Alex, it will be scored against um, South Africa when we drew 1 1. And even though I, I wish he did, it was in fact an own goal by Bully Makawanazi. So it wasn't Alex. That's well, he can't claim it. Was it on going on Well, I don't, I, don't, <laughs> I don't think he was to claim it. And also, this is the bit. I, I, I hope I don't make a mock up the well, Maybe you need a pair, new pair of glasses. I don't know. I mean. You mean? If you if you can't tell the difference between an I didn't goal. see the game, mate. I didn't see the game. Alex, right. I didn't see the game. I thought it's Alex. And like I just said, it's a correction. It wasn't Alex. It was Bule Makawanazi. So correction there. Right. Bully. So, Bule. 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 Oh, so I thought you said Bully. Bully. Is Bully South African? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, go on. Go okay. On. So now comes to the terrible part. I hope I didn't muck up the mic. I'm gonna have to. I have to actually apologise. So I hope no National United fans are listening. Because I called, I was out of order last week. I called Rude Van, I'll say his proper name, Rude Van Nistelrooy a cheat. And I have to say, I shouldn't have called him. And you know, you don't hear me apologise often, especially to Manchester United. So why are you apologising? I'm apologising because I, 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 I shouldn't have called him a cheat. I watched it back again. Well, you know when I thought he tried to get Patrick said no. I should not have called him a cheat and I, and I have to apologise. So hopefully no, you watch it again, you watch it yeah. again, he's still a cheat. No, no, I, but, I'm, I, but you're saying that. Because Vieira never was nowhere near yeah, it. Yeah, no, you're saying that, but I'm saying, listen, I'm trying to apologise. I thought well, you, you apologising? I thought you'd be happy, I mean, I thought you'd be what happy. What are you apologising for? Wait, wait, wait. He was I, nowhere near. Okay, but I That's thought, one thing you did get right. Okay, but I thought you'd be happy. I'm humbling myself now. I'm, Why are you apologising? Let me, let me finish, let me finish. You're I'm ridiculous. What about ridiculous, but let me finish my apology first. So before I was a rude instructor, I have to apologise. I should not have called Rude Van Nistelrooy a cheat. What I should have called him, the biggest cheat ever to, to be in the Premier League. That's what I should have called him. The biggest cheat in the world, in the whole history of the it. Premier League. No, is what I should have called him. Rude Van crap himself. That's what I should have called him. So I'm sorry for calling him. He's the biggest cheat the world of football has ever seen. I'm sorry for not calling him that. <laughs> That's a bit over the top, isn't it? It's not over the top. You still want to call me ridiculous? You still want to call me ridiculous? <laughs> yeah, you still want to call me ridiculous? <laughs> well, to call him the biggest ever. The biggest ever from the team that used to be the biggest chief in the whole history of the Premier League. From their manager, which I'm glad is okay health-wise, and their players. The biggest chief. The biggest chief ever. Well, bigger than Mike Riley. Bigger than, well, big, absolutely bigger, bigger, the biggest Oh, cheat. by the way, by the way, to finish off, what do you think about oh. the referee for saying? Who is it? 
Mike Bean. <laughs> I just let, thought I thought I'd let you wow. know. What do you think? I mean, wow. let's hope he... is that really right that Premier League putting a Tottenham fan in charge of a, <laughs> a man that a... celebrates Tottenham goals? Wow, that's a... wow, that's an interesting <laughs> point. But, yes, I mean, it's, I mean, yes. What do you well, think? Well, listen, are we up against twelve men? Well, we seem to sometimes play twelve men every week. So, but hopefully he does his job properly. All the best. Oh. All good. Good luck to the team. Tomorrow against um, Voslak. Voslak. A, a Voskla. Voslak. Pot Potolava. Voslak. And good luck to the team against Tottenham. Good luck to our ladies against Manchester City away. And good luck to that, Nigeria. Way, is, it the, is that on the box? I think it's on BT Sport. Hopefully it's on the BBC Red Barn. And good luck to Super Falcons on Sunday. Thank you very much for watching. See you next week. About to do a photo shoot for our new merch with our new logo, AFTV. You've seen it. We're at Unique Capture Studios in Milton Keynes. 